Hey all you gamers, if you're trying to get your hands on the Claymore unique item, which is the Heart Stealer, then stay tuned, that's coming up next. Welcome back everyone, if you're after this absolutely monster of a sword, let's see what it can do shall we? the big ears. I'm going to show you where the best place to get is now. So hopefully you already know but if you don't then whenever you click on an area it will show you all the possibility uh, possibly all the possible loot drops just down the bottom here. Now each one of these is basically the base version and it can give you all the variants so of course you can get all of the unique variants of each type of weapon that drops here. Now the best place that I have found for the Claymore drop is right here, the secret cow stage. So let's jump into that, I'll run you through and hopefully we'll get it at the end. But even if you don't get it first time, keep trying and you will eventually. Because pretty much same as everything else, the whole game is RNG. You could get on your first go, could get on your 31st if you're really unlucky, but fingers crossed you'll get it real quick. Now I'm being a little bit lazy here and I haven't equipped my speed gear, but I'm going to fast forward it all for you anyway, so don't worry about that. But if you're doing it yourself, chuck on your fastest gear, so your robe and your boots and probably your cloak and just go for everything. So here we are, we're just coming up to the boss now, so fingers crossed. Now look, it does a fair chunk of damage and this isn't, I wouldn't say this is the best version of it either. We've got an okay one, not perfect, not perfect by a long, long shot. Right, we've been unlucky there and we've only found a mace. However, I've run this quite a few times yesterday. Unfortunately, I completely forgot to capture the footage. And I would say roughly it's one out of, uh, I'd say probably one out of every 12 is the Heart Stealer. I only, I only received the Heart Stealer twice yesterday and I think I ran it about 23 times, give or take. So judging from that, obviously it's not the most runs, so I can't 100% say, but I would say very possibly 1 out of 12 chance. But like I said, could get on your first, could get on your 31st, it's all down to luck. Chuck on your very fastest gear, everything that's going to make you speed for it, and you'll get to the boss and kill the boss within 2 minutes. So even if it took you 15 goes, that's probably with loading screens and that, 35 minutes fingers crossed if it's not i apologize but it is all rng so like i said fingers crossed you'll get it real quick as always guys i hope that's helped you out a little bit um i'll be bringing a few videos showing where to get all of the loot drops uh that's up that's up uh next on my agenda and i'll be doing a few more build guides and a few other things so as always for all things xbox and for more minecraft dungeon stuff hit that subscribe Hit that like if you liked it, or drop a comment, and hit the bell icon for notifications. As always, take care, see you on the next day.